so uh, in, in today's lab uh, we are going to see a uh, uh, decoder uh, design in uh, xilinx right again a uh, decoder is a uh, very uh, important uh, uh, module uh, which can uh, realize several uh, functions okay we'll also see how to design an uh, a full adder using uh, 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 using a decoder in uh, this class right so uh, what is an uh, decoder uh, you have an uh, 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 three bits like this is an a uh, 3 to 8 uh, decoder uh, you have an a1 a if, if i give 000 here this particular uh, line will go high and if i give 00 on uh, one out here this particular line will go high and if i give 111 here one so for uh, eight different combinations only uh, one of the lines will uh, uh, go uh, high right uh, so this is how uh, you can write an uh, program uh, for an uh, decoder right so you have an uh, a b c right these are the three uh, inputs and these are the uh, output so inputs are a b c and outputs is d0 to uh, d7 right and and you, you can uh, assign the values for d0 it is not of a not of b and not of c like that means if a is, is 0 b is 0 c is 0 d0 will be uh, 0 okay so this is the kind of program which we uh, write uh, to uh, no, design and uh, decoder okay uh, so uh, there are uh, certain something known as uh, conditional uh, statements also right so let, let me uh, explain you that what it is uh, like it is like uh, if okay uh, if uh, no, here uh, no, select select is equal to 1 then f is equal to a else f is equal to b so this is the uh, syntax for an, an a conditional uh, statement okay uh, now uh, for example uh, if x is an output of a decoder uh, y is an uh, function if x no, uh, is, is, is 1 1 then uh, y is equal to this that means uh, if if the uh, third bit uh, no, of the uh, x x is again uh, need not uh, obviously x in you know, within bracket uh, 3 means okay that means in uh, x is like 1 2 3 right it, it is an a uh, 2 to 4 decoder for exam uh, example which is given here probably so x is equal to 3 bit if the msb is 1 okay uh, then if the M msb is then then y is equal to 1 1 okay so it becomes i think a priority an uh, uh, encoder like uh, so these are if uh, statements how it is used else if 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 the uh, second bit of x is equal to an uh, 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 1 this is the format to uh, write uh, you know one this we learnt in the last class right and uh, it is one one bit and it is one okay so if the second uh, bit of x is uh, one then y is equal to this uh, else if if the uh, third uh, bit like x one is one then y is equal to this uh, else y is equal if, if these three conditions are uh, not met then y is equal to this so this is just an example okay uh, this is not an uh, decoder uh, this is just an example of using uh, uh, if and else okay so uh, this can be uh, written like this right okay uh, now uh, if you see uh, this decoder uh, initially uh, we uh, uh, we wrote uh, this like this is gate level uh, modeling so if i have to write a uh, data flow modeling so i can write a uh, program uh, like this okay uh, now uh, what is uh, uh, in uh, okay Th that is in is then uh, now we are defining the uh, input as an and uh, a uh, three bit data so two zero in so in in is a three bit data uh, output is an uh, eight bit data right so we we, we write uh, this kind of statements assign out that is out okay uh, if in is equal to right and uh, it is equal to uh, uh, zero 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 then an uh, uh, output will be eight bit zero 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 one right that means the topmost line will be one uh, in this case that's what we learned here here right if it is zero 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 this line needs to be uh, activated so that is what now we are writing here the topmost line will be activated uh, if in is equal to zero zero one right it is three bit uh, zero zero one okay the, so that is why we are uh, defining it, it like this then the next line will be high uh, for the next uh, this will be high then it will be this will be high then this will be high this will be high so this is how uh, no, we write okay this is an uh, default condition so generally uh, no, it is a good practice uh, to uh, write in uh, default uh, conditions also if, if nothing although we have covered 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 okay uh, although all the conditions have been uh, covered but uh, uh, it is uh, a good practice whenever we write programs to write a default conditions for for any reason if, if none of these inputs are uh, uh, matching uh, then 
the default will be uh, the output will be uh, this okay uh, so that is what uh, we can uh, write that kind of uh, uh, instructions also right now if i have to make an um, uh, full adder okay uh, using this uh, decoder so the input is an uh, three uh, 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 three bit data right so uh, a b c so i am taking it as in okay uh, in is all the three a b c and output is an uh, sum and uh, carry okay so since i am going to use a, a decoder i am going to uh, use an a uh, wire okay uh, 70 so with the uh, uh, no, uh, uh, <coughs> decoder okay i am using decoder first i will make a decoder this i'll demonstrate to you this is g uh, input is uh, in which is the uh, uh, bits which requires to be added okay in is three bits so a b c and the output is uh, w w is a wire right and for some if you see here uh, so if you do an or operation between w1 w2 w4 uh, the decoder outputs right like for uh, if it is all uh, 0 0 0 0 uh, like if a a b c are uh, uh, 0 0 0 then some will be 0 and hence w0 is not here but if uh, for 0 0 1 right and uh, uh, the sum will be one so one is taken here uh, and for uh, 0 0 uh, uh, 0 1 0 is 2 right so in that case also sum will be uh, one here right and and for an uh, uh, three like it uh, it will be an uh, 0 1 1 so 1 1 if you add uh, you will get an a uh, one zero so the carry will be generated so it is k three is here uh, and then four is one zero zero and hence that is here only there is only one one there uh, in uh, w similarly in five also there is only uh, there are uh, two ones and hence uh, uh, you have a carry here uh, and some zero or uh, for six also there are uh, two ones here so there is a carry here and for seven you have uh, all the three uh, inputs as one 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 here so and hence there will be some as well as a carry so this is how a uh, full adder can be uh, 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 implemented uh, using an uh, decoder okay so uh, let me uh, demonstrate that to you okay so uh, first let me uh, create a, a folder left five Lab five. Okay. Okay. And uh, here, let me add an, a new source, a Verilog module. Oh, sorry, Verilog module. Let me uh, call it as decoder. Right. So, uh, let me uh, copy and paste the decoder uh, code uh, which we uh, studied here. So, decoder, I go to uh, simulation. Let me first do a uh, syntax check. Right, so this is working uh, fine. Simulate behavioral model. Right, so I have. So let me uh, just if I give uh, 0, 0, 0 here, uh, here output the first line uh, should be uh, activated. Right, so uh, force constant. So let me uh, uh, give a binary uh, 0, 0, 0. Okay, and then I uh, run it so you see here the first line is uh, activated uh, similarly if I uh, go to force constant and then I give uh, 0 uh, 0 0 1 sorry 0 0 1 okay uh, and then uh, if I run this here you will find it is all zeros the last one is one now the second line and will has to be activated okay because I have given uh, one out here instead of a zero 
so uh, if I give it no, now, now you can see the uh, second line has uh, got uh, activated. So that is how an uh, decoder would uh, work like. Like if you keep uh, changing the value here, only uh, one of the lines will go high at any uh, given uh, time. Okay, so uh, that is about how an uh, decoder works. Uh, and then uh, now we can also uh, make an uh, full adder. So let me uh, make an uh, full adder. And uh, very low module. Full adder. So uh, I have an uh, full adder module. So let me uh, copy the paste, copy the code which we discussed here. Right. Now I am going to uh, use the uh, de decoder as an uh, unit out here, right? So I, uh, this is what we discussed. So uh, full adder. So let's do. Let's see if there is any uh, syntax error. Okay, there is nothing. Uh, so uh, let let us make an uh, 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 test bench out here for the uh, for the uh, full adder new source test bench so that uh, uh, all eight uh, conditions will uh, check for that test uh, full adder for the full adder so uh, i have an uh, uh, this this uh, test so So uh, let me uh, give uh, input from zero to seven, right? So all all possible input combinations. Now, uh, let me uh, do that. So let me check this uh, syntax first. That is uh, working fine, and then I do the behavioral test. Right now, uh, if you see here, uh, input is zero, zero, zero. That is an uh, A, B, C is zero. Sum is zero and carry is zero. And then I have a uh, zero, zero, one. Like A zero, B zero, and carry in is one. So I have uh, sum is equal to one out here. And zero, one, zero. Uh, again, there is only a uh, one out here. So the sum is one, carry zero. A uh, zero, one, one. So this will generate an uh, uh, sum is equal to zero and carry is equal to one. So you'll find uh, sum is equal to zero, carry is equal to one. Again, I have a uh, one, zero, zero. Uh, sum going one, carry zero. One, zero, one. Again, uh, you will have carry one, uh, sum zero. One, one, zero also. And uh, uh, sum zero, uh, carry one. And one, one, one. You have both the uh, sum and uh, carry one. So for all the eight uh, combinations. So uh, what we have learned is uh, how to uh, make an uh, full adder yeah, uh, uh, using a decoder. So we learned about a decoder design and also we learned about how to implement a uh, full adder uh, using a uh, decoder. Okay, so uh, that's all for today.